Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm going to do a quick update on some VHS and some DVDs I picked up in the last week or so. Starting off, I got this today at Rose's, of all places. It was only five bucks. It was The Beast Within. This movie's from 1981, and I've always wanted to see this. I've never seen it. And the old VHS cover looks similar to this right here. If you can see that. Now, a few people have said this is a little slow. I've heard, I've heard it's kind of slow. I'm just more interested in the monster transformation scene. That's what draws me to werewolf movies in general. Like, I really like Silver Bullet and Bad Moon and um, all those, you know, the, the werewolf off of uh, Waxwork. Stuff like that, like the transformation scenes, like in, in the Howling movies. The next movie I picked up, and I did show this in the last video briefly, is Late Night Hours. It's a short film from my buddy Will. He's on the Fright Tube, and uh, I will put his... I'll put his um, links down below here. And I think it's Will C T V. I believe that's his name, but uh, I'll have it up. Or I'll, excuse me, I'll have it underneath here for you. Okay, and the next uh, movie I picked up was the Poison Ivy triple feature. I got this at um, got this at Big and Small Lots, and I think it was only like six bucks. It's got Poison Ivy one, Poison Ivy Lily, and Poison Ivy the New Seduction. And uh, I've got to say, Part Three is my favorite for. Probably obvious reasons. It stars Jamie Presley. Okay, uh, this VHS I picked up at Roses, of all places, Roses. Uh, so if anybody has local Roses, you, you need to go and check and see what they've gotten. Because, I mean, I've got the Beast Within, which is a pretty cool DVD for five bucks. And they've also got a couple of VHS, like two for five. And I got this. This is a double pack. It's uh, 100 Years of Horror. Frankenstein, Monsters, and Mad Scientists. And it's hosted by Christopher Lee, and it shows all these cool old clips of mostly Hammer films. Some black and white, some color. Uh, some of the newer stuff and what, like, different incarnations of Frankenstein's monster and all that good stuff. All right, the last VHS I picked up was Angel Heart. Stars Robert De Niro. It has Mickey Rourke and um, Lisa Bonet. And one of the reasons why I got it was because of Lisa Bonet. Uh, this movie is pretty crazy from what I've seen of it so far. It's uh, like a horror thriller. Two for five bucks, man. Uh, uh, roses, you can't beat it. So if anybody has a local Roses, like I say, go go pick some stuff up. Because for some reason they've, they've got all this weird stuff that nobody else like Walmart or nobody like that or, uh, you know, is carrying nowadays. Okay, and lastly, I just wanted to uh, do a couple shout-outs. Uh, Midnight Scream Fest, uh, everybody needs to go over and sub him. He's the old Dark Visions TV, and uh, I believe Outer Space 09 was his other login. And uh, he's finally back on YouTube. He's been back for a while, but uh, for some reason I forgot to mention that he was back, so please go sub him. A um, couple other new YouTubers that uh, that I've recently come across, uh, Movie Overlord, uh, won one of his contests, and uh, the dude's only got like a little over 100 subscribers, and he needs more, man. He's, he's got a good collection of stuff, so go over there and sub him. Um, congratulations on Jared, JLD Films. He got 600 subs. That's awesome, man. I uh, hope, to, hope to be there one day. I've, I've almost got 300 myself, so I'm working on it. All right, and uh, lastly, the only thing I wanted to talk about is my bu buddy Movie John. He burned me a couple cool DVDs. Um, and he's going to burn me a couple more, but he, I got the burning now on a burnt disc, uh, which is awesome. I love that movie, and it's so expensive on DVD to find. Uh, he burned me Cabin Fever 2, which is playing in the background. Haven't watched it yet. I've heard it's not very good, but, you know, hey, I'll give it a watch. Uh, a couple more, and he also burnt, uh, burnt me the Mutilator, and it's not even on um, a DVD yet. It's a rip from a VHS. And I think I'm going to leave you with a clip from the Mutilator.